Hey guys, in this video I'm gonna introduce you some of the best boilerplate that I found a couple of days ago. Actually, I decided to create a blog using Next.js as my first project that I'm using Next.js inside that. So instead of uh, creating a pure Next.js using NPX, I decided to pick a good and active boilerplate and then begin my development with kind of zero initial configuration. Okay, without any further detail, let's begin the first one. This one actually the one that I'm really passionate about and I will use it in my blog actually because it's well integrated with stuff that i really love them such as tailwind typescript eslint prettier and especially these cute things that i don't know them very well but i think they are essential for seo and bundle analyzer as well and it's especially uh, good if you uh, want to write some blocks that contain uh, codes and so on yeah that's it okay uh, this one is also good for blogging but it's more simpler and uh, it's also supporting SEO optimization uh, pagination tagging and so on and also integrated with a uh, Netlify if you want to deploy on Netlify it would be a good choice for you uh, the next one is actually not uh, specific for blogging it's kind of specific for PWA if you want to create a project using Next.js and also you want it be PWA it would be a good choice because it has lots of contributor and also it seems to active uh, repository and uh, the next one is actually good for those who want to create e-commerce website an online shop that helps you buy some stuff online I don't know uh, but it's also a good active repository with lots of contributors and also has a good reputation and the last one is this repo that has good uh, integration with redux and i18 next and some other stuff if you are interested you can pick it and uh, use it that's it i hope you find this video helpful and i hope you Pick one of them and use in your next, next <laughs> JS project. Uh, please like this video and subscribe my channel if you won't already. See you soon.